you have a separate source file and a target file now you want to put all this this content into your translation memory so now let's say you have a english file and a target yoruba or whatever your language now you did not use trados for the translation because you didn't learn trados till today so you want to use that separate source and target file translated without a trados you want to import that into your tm so this is also very important building that memory from the past translation that were done without trados okay so how to do that it is very simple uh, but it's hectic but uh, the topic will take only 5 minutes so here align document aligning source and target okay so click align single file pair you have to add your tm in which tm should it be added okay the source okay now let's say uh, this is a source file and this is a target file okay we have added the tm we have added the separate source file and the target file both should have the same content and same formatting otherwise it will not work next we'll show the language you finish it will come like a thing you have to see whether this line corresponds to this if it is wrong you disconnect it if it is right you connect one to one if something is wrong you disconnect and you have to select this that like that you have to connect one on one or connect uh, more than one like that so you have to check each and everything and say connect one to one like that you have to anyway it is hectic only but there is no other option you have to check from first segment to last to see your english file content is here my french file content is here the last here so both are aligned sentence by sentence this is simple file so it appears simple but if it is a very big file with a lot of full stop double spacing and all the alignment will go wrong you may have to take a lot of time so once everything is con sure you say confirm all so everything becomes green and after that import into translation memory so import okay i repeat whatever work done without trados outside the trados environment those source and target separate file content you want to import into the tm so you are importing sometime if this is hectic maybe you can save this when you give save it will be saving as a sdl align project which you can open later that is one thing next thing is you can save this file as a sdl xlib and then later browse it and open it there you can do the editing instead of connecting disconnecting see i'm saving this as a sdl xlib file which is the editor file i'm going to welcome and browse and see target underscore scores dot sdl xlib just now saved i open it so it will open here like a translation file wait a second that content will come see you can usually do edit doing there is one method doing here is another method okay okay